All right, so you want to upgrade your older AMD FSR 3.0 mode to the latest one, which is AMD FSR 3.1, which comes with some of the new changes like better stability in performance or image quality. And even if you don't want to upgrade or you are just want to install the 3.1 mode as a new, so you have come to the right place. So first of all, we have to download these modes. So of course, these modes are paid, but you can get them for free from my Discord server. You will find the link in the description. So the mode which which now have the 3.1 AMD FSR is called Uniscalar Preview 10. You can simply download from here. And first section of this video is going to be for those who already have Uniscalar, any older Uniscalar mode in their game and i am taking for an example for this video red dead redemption 2 this will work pretty much in many games which already supports any older mode by luke fz so this mode is going to work on these all games so let's just take rdr2 so let's take that you have already installed any older uniscalar version like uniscalar 10 uniscalar 9 and you want to upgrade to 3.1 so here are the files of Uniscalar 10 which have the 3.1 AMD FSR. First copy these three files here inside the main game folder. Just simply drag and drop. Then, op then simply copy this Uniscalar folder as whole. Don't open the folder, just simply copy entire folder inside the main game. And inside this stub nvngs folder, you only need enable signature overdrive.reg. No other file than this. Only enable signature overdrive.reg inside your main game directory where the exe is located. Like my rdr 2 exe is located here. And whichever game you are taking it, just make sure that the game's exe is located inside the folder where you are pasting these mode files. Once you paste it, simply double click on enable signature overdrive.reg click OK and that's all if you have an NVIDIA GPU that's all for you you can just simply open your game select FSR inside game and it will work with the frame generation but let's just take that you are experiencing some of the crashing issues or if you have AMD or Intel GPU so you can counter these problems first you have to launch the game one time at least launch the game one time after installing the mode then close your game and you will get this file inside the main game folder which is called uniscalar.config.toml simply open this file and inside here if you have AMD or Intel GPU you don't have NVIDIA GPU then you have to scroll down here and you have to enable fake NVIDIA GPU just simply click here on fake NVIDIA GPU and set this from false to true and if you are experiencing some of the crashing issues even on the NVIDIA GPU you can enable fake NVAIP results which in my in my experience helps me to counter some of the crashing issues here just simply here this will be false as original just simply click true and if you are like using this mode in any of the EA game like you can see here EA EGS and Ubisoft game which have their own overlay blocker and if you are playing one of these companies game basically they have a overlay which will block the mode so you will have to also true this value which is called disable overlay blocker just simply click this true as well this will help to uh, counter crashing problems in the game uh, made by these all company which have these their uh, crap overlay inside their game so pretty much this and just simply save the config file but now let's take that you don't have any older amd fsr mode and you just want to install amd fsr 3.1 as a new mode you don't have any mode previously and it's also very simple just simply copy again all of these files here copy it and then just all uniscalar folder and then from the stub and bngs enable signature overdrive.reg and then simply enable signature overdrive.reg and that's all you can you can experience the amd fsr 3.1 in your game but if you have any older mode installed like uh, like like the luke fz 220 mode or dlss enable or blah blah any modes installed uh, other than uniscalar you will have to delete them before installing the uniscalar mode otherwise uniscalar won't going to work so let's just see that you have installed any other amd fsr mode instead of uniscalar previously so you will have to delete those files first and then you have to install the uniscalar in order to get this working so that's all in my opinion we can just simply launch the game here 
and you can see if this if this command promote opens when you open the game means the mode has been installed successfully and you can get the AMD FSR 3.1 in your game so that's all here and I hope this video is helpful and if you have any doubts you can leave them in the comment box and join the discord server to get the modes for free and that's all for this video thank you so much for watching and i catch you in next one bye